to weekly vlog 50. I cannot believe we are at 50, that is crazy. So please excuse if I'm not looking at the camera a lot, but I am driving, so I need to be looking at the road. Two hands on the wheel and looking at the road. So yeah, it's Tuesday, you guys know, I don't really record on Mondays, blah, blah, blah. So I have been in the house for too many days, like constantly in the house. Like if you guys know last week, like if you watched last week, it was pretty boring, wasn't it? I was in the house working on secret project, just oh, doing everything I needed to do in the house, which I still have loads of things to do. So I kind of wanted to be working on secret project again today because it's getting down to the nitty gritty. Like I really need to do it. But if you watched at the end of last week's weekly vlog, you will know that I said that I couldn't get my hands on the February Mickey Memories plush from Disney Store because it's sold out. Well, I know somebody that works at the Newcastle Disney Store and she said that somebody reserved one and never picked it up. So she's now reserved it for me. So I am going through to my sister's. I've got some more boxes in the back. If you watched last week, then you know what that's about as well. So I'm taking out some boxes and I am um, going up to hers and then we're going to go into Newcastle and I don't know if we're going to Metro Centre as well if you normally watch you'll know that Amy's the biggest faff in the world so we probably won't even end up going out to the shops till like five o'clock tonight honestly it's just terrible we're gonna go out to Newcastle I've said like I don't mind too much if we don't get the Metro but I need to go to the Disney store because I only have the plush reserved until closing tonight so I need to go and get this plush I can't afford the plush I should be working on a secret project there's so many reasons why I should not be going out today, but I'm going out and I'm going to get this plush. So the life of a Disney merchandise addict. Please do not use me as a role model, guys. I am not a good example, but I do need a day off. Like I do need to, and plus I'm not having a complete day off. I'm still remote. I'm still getting stuff out the garage so that I can have my garage back for Secret Project. So I'm going to go out today. Plus I haven't been feeling very good the last two days. I keep getting really dizzy. Uh, I know why. Mother Nature's here. If you've been watching me a while, you'll know that Mother Nature and me don't have a good relationship. So I'm looking forward to the next two weeks after my Mother Nature visit because that's normally when my hormones are the worst. And I better not have two weeks of headaches again because I can't take that. I really can't. I'm just going to go up to my sister's, go into town, get my Mickey Memories plush. If we do go to Metro Centre, I'm also going to get the cup, but I'm going to get that at the Metro Centre store because, oh no! I was so organised. I've forgotten my Metro Centre gift voucher. Dawn, Dawn, Dawn. That's so annoying. I was so organised. I've got the 20% off voucher. I've got like something I need to take back. I've got all these boxes in my car. I'm so annoyed I've done that. Well, we're not getting the cup today then. The cup hasn't sold out though. There's still January cups left, so I'm not worried. So yeah, I really don't care if we go to Metro now because I haven't got my voucher anyway. We're gonna have a look at Newcastle Primark as well because I haven't been there in so long and they've got the Marie Bending. I still haven't seen the Hello Kitty range if there's any left because that was quite a while ago. So yeah, we're just gonna go out and do a bit of shopping and hopefully Amy will actually be ready and we'll be going out and it will have a good day and then tomorrow i will have to get on with work i have to get on with work and i really shouldn't be getting this plush but never mind as long as like you know you're not going to put yourself in a really bad financial situation and it makes you happy so why not but i will say that it really angered me that i found out that um people are already putting the plushes on uh what you call it on ebay somebody right now when i looked uh last night is selling a january memory plush for 126 pound and people were bidding on that that's disgusting like it makes me want the february and to collect them all even more so then it's like i, I managed to collect them i didn't always get them on the day that they were released but i managed to get them all and i didn't have to pay horrible ebay fees like i think it's absolutely disgusting that people are doing that we had it bad enough of the prime market and the beast stuff so yeah never mind if you haven't managed to get one check facebook groups ask all your friends on instagram that's what i do so yeah, I've managed to get one, so I'm gonna go and get it. Also, people on eBay are putting in pre-orders for the March one. So it hasn't been released yet, they haven't got it, but they're promising people for money that they'll get them the March one. That's disgusting. Oh, and you can use your 20% off voucher on the Mickey Memories. That really annoyed me as well, because I didn't use it on my January ones, because the Metro Centre staff told me that I wasn't allowed. But apparently they're not actually classed as limited edition. So you can buy as many as you 
one it's not like one or two per customer hence why people are putting them on ebay and you can use 20 percent off on, on them so that really annoyed me that i got told that um by the metro center disney store staff so yeah next time i'm in i will be using 20 percent off on the cup and i will be getting it on the cup like i'm gonna tell them everyone i know has used that 20 percent off voucher so you're the only store in the country that's not letting people do it anyway i'm rambling i'm rambling i'm gonna go to my sisters and then we're gonna go shopping and we're gonna get my plush and yeah then we're gonna have a good day it's gonna be fun and then we need to get on with some work tomorrow I think you like Peter Pan. He's really excited. Oh, oh, I think he likes. Oh, Amy, give him Genie. Mm. I feel like he really likes Hans. Not Hans, Christoph. I keep saying that it's not Hans. Why does he like him so much? I've got 20% off. He really likes it. He does, doesn't he? Maybe you should put Frozen on for him.
Hey guys, I am now back home. I've got such a croaky voice because I'm so tired. So I don't know how much you managed to make up today, but I'm pretty sure by now you know that if I go anywhere with my sister, why am I not in the middle? We don't get a lot done um, because Logan, my little nephew, really just doesn't like being out in about too long, like, ugh. So we went to Disney store first. I got my plush and I got the cup as well from the memories. So thank you to Sarah who works in that store who kept it back for me. Um, that was really nice of her. Basically somebody, I think I already said, somebody else kept it back, didn't go and get it. So she messaged me and she was like, there's still one here if you want one. So she kept it for me. So that was great. So I managed to get my February the here but i will show you them properly like tomorrow i'm just really tired right now i'll get them out and we'll look at the january one as well so yeah um i got that and then we went to next which i didn't film because we were literally in the baby section um and then we went and got food which i did film and my lo my, my logan my nephew was just screaming and oh lord he's so embarrassing it wasn't good and then we went round to primark and i haven't been in that primark in so long months like i haven't seen the hello kitty range I haven't seen a lot of new stuff like I just the metro center one's not very good and that's the only one I've been going to so yeah I was literally in the Newcastle one not even five minutes and he would not stop screaming so my sister was like we're gonna have to go and lately I've been taking a separate car so that when she leaves I can stay in shop but because we went to Newcastle I went in her car because I didn't want to pay for separate parking so when she wanted to leave I had to leave so I literally speed of light looked at the hello kitty stuff but i had stuff in my basket which i had to abandon because he was screaming and she had to leave right there and then um so yeah i didn't get the hello kitty jumper that i wanted I qu like what you seen is what i saw like i didn't have a look at things i quickly shot with the camera and then ran out and she was like ringing us like hurry up and i was like i need footage <laughs> like i want to show you guys at least so yeah i didn't manage to get any of the hello kitty range i found the nails the villains and Dalma dalmatians nails put them in my basket and yeah had to like quickly try and put everything back because I couldn't go go to the till basically. So yeah, um, we also met my little sister and her girlfriend and they came into Primark with us but we weren't with them very long when my sister was like, he's screaming like we'll have to go. We were walking around to the car and he fell asleep. I was like, are you kidding us? I was like, do you want to go back to Primark? But there was a busker outside and he was really loud. So she was like, if we go back around there, he'll wake up. But if we go to the car, I'll have to get him out of the car seat and then he'll wake up. So I rang my little sister and I was like, have you gone like for a drink? And she was like, yeah, we've literally just gone around the corner. So we went round um, and met them for a drink and that's what you'll have seen us all sat down. Um, they didn't have any soy milk, so I just had to get a mocktail. Um, I love mojito mocktails, but it was mojito and ginger, which I don't really like, but it was, it was all right. I like Jamie's, Jamie's in Newcastle is good. They do amazing like kettles though and like, like little teapots, sorry and stuff when you have a cup of tea and I really fancied it, but didn't have any soy milk and I didn't want black tea so yeah we were in there and then it was getting quite late and my sister needed to like get the bed home and get him fed and get him in a bath and to bed and stuff so that was all we did I mean at least I got to see my little sister and uh, her girlfriend which was nice because I haven't seen them since Christmas but we didn't get a lot done and I thought maybe we would get to go back around to Primark but we didn't so I didn't even get a good look on Primark so all I achieved today was I got my Mickey memories plush <laughs> Does this keep going fuzzy? My eyes. I'm really tired. But yeah, so then I've just come home. I went back to my sister's and got my car and then... It isn't focusing on me, is it? What are you doing? So I tried to film as much as I could. But um, yeah, bit of a... It always is a bit of a fail if I go off my sister though. Like she's absolutely terrible. And normally, like I say, I would normally take my own car. So I still want to go back to Primark and have a good look camera i don't know what this camera's doing maybe if i try doing it like that i really wanted to have a good look around like, i could have been in there for hours and then gone up to costa but never mind never mind <laughs> i'm not even the one with the baby and i'm the one having to live the baby lifestyle and leave early it's not fair but anyway so that was today i got my mickey's memories that's all i bought i didn't even get to take the thing back to river island that i wanted to take back so that was a little bit annoying but never mind matthew last week was working on a presentation all week and that's like i was working on my secret project and he was working on a presentation that he was doing outside of work because he was doing a presentation uh somewhere else like on like his like what he works for like what he do, he's a physiotherapist basically so he was doing a presentation somewhere that was today so today's normally his day off tuesday but he had that presentation today so it went really well um he went out before i did and then he rang us afterwards and 
yeah, it went really well for him, bless him. He was really nervous. And you can still see his like suit jacket and stuff's here. Anyway, I'm gonna go get to bed. I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, it is actually Thursday. So, um, like I said on Tuesday, I think I said I was gonna be at the computer all day uh, on Wednesday, so yesterday, and I was, and I didn't even time lapse it because obviously there's a lot of things like that I'm working on, secret project, that I'm not particularly ready to have on the internet yet. So yeah, I didn't even end up time lapsing it, and I was at the computer all day. I did nothing else. I got a really bad headache as well from being at the computer all the live long day. I'm just putting my shoes on. The annoying thing is as well is I didn't even get as much work done as I would want to get done for the headache that I got from sitting at the computer all day. Like editing doesn't even normally give me a headache that bad. It was such a horrible headache and the only reason I can think why is because I don't know I guess I'm really working really hard to try and get the secret project off the ground and just like strain at the computer so anyway yeah so I've still got a bit of a headache today because it was a really bad one there's something in my shoe and it's really annoying me my pink iron rocks for the gym these are mine and my sister's brand either dm me to order or this is not sponsored it's just my brand <laughs> it's a shameless plug dm to order or shortshoeme.com we also do fully encrusted sparkly ones and my sister's actually making the purple ones into hulk ones as well at the minute which is pretty cool so yeah, anyway, what was I saying? I've still got a bit of a headache this morning, but I think I said on Tuesday it is my time of the month, so I'm very prone to headaches. I'm just hoping that this goes away and doesn't end up being two weeks of headaches like last month, because I really can't take that. Sorry I didn't record yesterday, that is the gist of that. Ugh, get my shoe on! We have to undo the laces to get the shoe on, Sarah. Today, I have quite a lot to do. It's Matthew's longer day at work. Oh, I'm so like, I haven't posted on Instagram in four days, Secret Project is nowhere near, like, at the place where I want it to be. I haven't um, edited another video. I've got one recorded. You know, and then you've just got so much to do. I haven't been to the gym since last week. So I'm going to quickly go to the gym now. Like, to be honest, I don't have time. But I'll, you know, I joined for a reason. So I'm going to make time. So I'm going to go to the gym. Then I've got to go to Pets at Home. Because the rabbit has run out of stuff again. Oh, then I've got to go to Asda. Because we have no food in. And Matthew is away. Uh, tomorrow after work till Saturday night. It's just one night. He's going away with his friends. And there we go. Phew. I look really weird. Anyway, yeah, so he's going away with his friends just for one night. His friends do that a lot. I mean, I don't know how many times it comes across on camera. If you've been watching me for a while, you'll probably know that. But yeah, it's just man trips. Like, he does always say you're invited, but I'm really not interested in camping in the middle of the a field in the middle of winter. So he can do that if he wants to, but I'm going to stay home with the moon. Where's the bun? I can hear the bun, I can't see the bun. Anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna go to the gym, go to pets at home, then we've gotta do a weekly shop, like I've gotta do a weekly shop. Now the gym is tiring enough, and Asda is tiring enough, so doing both might be a really stupid thing for me to do. But they need doing, and then when I get back, I think I'll have a bath, and just chill for an hour or two, because I will be knackered from that. And then I'll be carrying on with Secret Project, like I need to like, I'm behind, like, it's just my own deadlines, but it's just, it's getting a bit like, yeah bit stressed so so I will take you with me let's go out quickly because it's getting on what is it like tw after 12 it's four minutes to 12 so yeah I was just doing a bit of email and stuff this morning so yeah let's go I recorded it was so quiet it was lush there was me an old man and I think another lass and then she went down the other end and then a, a young lad like there was nobody in that gym there was a class on upstairs and I think that's why but it was lush so I actually managed to record as well it was so good I had a good workout as well like sometimes when I go on my own I don't really enjoy it as much but like I don't know if it's because I haven't been for a few days so I could work a bit harder because I was a bit more rested but yeah 
good workout currently can't lift my arms like i am leaning the camera on my arm it hurts on my legs sorry it hurts so bad i'm gonna have to do an asda shot with jelly legs now <laughs> but yeah so i just nipped it in pets at home i think i showed you the cute little bunnies and then um i just nipped it in home bargains and they had like a princess storage bag so i could whip the camera out for that but yeah i always get funny looks when i record around here so but at least i'm, I'm trying i'm trying we don't want it to be boring like last week but yeah so that's all the shops I need to go to apart from Asda. So I'm now gonna go to Asda, but I won't take the camera in because I'm gonna be carting around a big trolley. Like we need a full shop and I find it hard to push a trolley around anyway never mind with like trying to record at the same time so my sister rang us in home bargains as well i had a basket i had my handbag and the camera and then i had to like have the phone up and i had such jelly arms i was like amy and she was just bored honestly she's such a faff she's the biggest faff in the world i still can't record my what i got for my birthday haul until amy gives us my hades picture honestly she's terrible i was actually watching a movie last night with the actor who voiced hades in it it was really weird because like he just doesn't match his voice at all but anyway yeah so i'm gonna get around to as it and I'll speak to you guys when I get home. Little bunny. Ooh. <gasps> ah. You didn't eat all your green beans? Get them eaten as well. I've just gotten back from Asda. I'm so out of breath. I'm just like, that was so tiring. How do people push a trolley around Asda and not have like a cardiac arrest? Seriously. But anyway, like, I can't keep my eyes open. I'm so tired. Like, between the gym, pets at home, and Asda. Woo! I'm exhausted. And I have to just give the rabbit some stuff. His box is an absolute mess. He's shredded the insides. And he's got my good blanket as well. What a pest. Um, so that me and Matthew can't use it for a cinema box again. Just put the shopping away. I left the camera in the car when I was doing the shopping away. But there wasn't too much different to what I bought and showed you last time. Like, maybe some, like, chicken nuggets. And, I don't know, not much. A few things. But, yeah, I'm just, um... I'm going to make myself a cup of tea and get in the bath because I literally can't keep my eyes open and chill for a bit. And then I'll get on with some work and I will try and show you the Mickey Memories plushes at some point. Like, I can't even hold the camera up, I'm so tired. So I need to go and chill for an hour and then I'm going to get on with work. That was so weird. I seen something go past the window and then someone knock on the door. And I have neighbours that like to, like, knock on the door, like kids, and run away. Uh, they do it well it's actually one kid i think he does it loads and it's really annoying and his parents should teach him not to do that but i never answer the door because i know it's him like i can look out the window and there's nobody there like i don't need to answer the door no nobody's there but anyway it wasn't the annoying little kid from the other like over the road it was my little brother so i was at the window and i was trying to see if i could see him because I, I think i seen him run around the side of the house and i was like well i'm not having that because it's my garage so i'll go out and i'll tell him to go away and then literally i was about to go out and be like right child and then it was my little brother i don't know why but i ordered i ordered a dvd the other day really cheap because i'm skinned but i just really fancied watching it like i love 90s movies and i love sylvester stallone movies and i haven't seen this movie properly and it popped in my head and i don't even know why i did this but it was 149 on ebay and for some reason it went to my nana's house i used to live there so i don't know why it's gone to my nana's house but anyway so my little brothers just dropped it off with me nana and um, they've gone straight back they've, like they have to go but look what i ordered <laughs> the specialist with sharon stone and sylvester stallone now i've seen it i ordered it and then i found it online for free well what happened was i found it online for free and i was watching it and it kept freezing and it was really annoying and then i managed to kind of just get through it and watch it but now i can watch it without freezing and i'm sure matthew will want to watch it as well so maybe me and matthew will watch that but he's out till late tonight and like he's at work 12 hours today and then he's away tomorrow night so we might be able to watch it on saturday or sunday night just thought i'd share that with you because it's hilarious and if you haven't seen it then I think it's an 18, yeah, it's an 18, I was gonna say. <laughs> it's an 18, but uh, yeah, it's a good movie. Just anything 90s, this is 94, I believe, 96, 94. I was four years old. Gotta love a Sylvester Sloan movie. <laughs> hey guys, it is the next day, it is Friday. Whew. It's actually the evening now. I don't even know what time it is, like six o'clock or something. I have been at the computer all day. I can't remember when I spoke to you yesterday. Uh, Oh, it's all just a blur. Like, I'm, li I'm like, constantly at the computer working on a secret project. Like, it's so huge and it's so stressful and, like, there's still so much to do. Like, you could say I'm still in the beginning stages, which I know is probably not what you want to hear because it's taken up so much time, like, in YouTube videos and stuff. And also, loads of people have already messaged me saying, what is it? Like, what is secret project? So, it will become clear, hopefully, 
I don't know, maybe a month. Or I don't know. It's going to take a lot longer than I thought. It's just, oh, it's so complicated. But anyway, um, so yes, it is Friday afternoon. I've been at the computer all day. I didn't time lapse it because the stuff on the computer, obviously, I'm not ready to have out on the internet yet. But then I realised I could just time lapse from another angle. So I'll probably be at the computer all day again tomorrow because Matthew's away tonight, like I said, on his little man trip. So I'm going to be at the computer all night. Um, although I have been at the computer all day, I think I might have the night off. And then I think I'm going to be at, well, I know I'm going to be at the computer all day tomorrow. So I'll probably time lapse a little bit just so you can see that I'm not lying. I'm, I'm, I am just at the computer working. And there's just nothing else for me to record. And I know I should do stuff in between. But that's literally all I'm doing. Like, show you stuff in between. But literally, I run downstairs, make up tea and come straight back up. Like, it's so stressful. I'm so warm. Okay, I thought we would go over the January and February plushes and cups. So I didn't get the pins just because I shouldn't even be getting the cups or the plushes. Never mind both of them. Like, I am skint. Like, seriously skint. Like, scary skint. Like, it's not good. So I, uh, yeah, I shouldn't be getting either. But I didn't want to get the pins because I get a lot of pins when I go to Disneyland Paris. Well, the last two times I have. And actually, all times I've gone to Disneyland, I've come back with a pin. They end up sitting on my desk, which is lovely. But if I get too many of them, it'll be too many. And I know you could get the book with the January one to put them in. And then it could have been like a collection. But it's just another thing in the house. And they are beautiful. But yeah, it was kind of like... If I had the money, I probably would have. But at the same time, at the end of the year, I'm already spending a lot of money on the cups and plushes. So I know I've already shown you the January one. So... I'll just show you again. But I just thought we would do like a comparison. So this is January. And this is the February one I picked up on Tuesday, I think. I went with Amy. The days are blurring thanks to being at the computer all the time. The February plush's face is actually a little bit thinner, smaller. Like as soon as I showed Matthew, like that was one of the first things he said. So neither of them have gloves on. He's like, like a fake leather kind of material so you can see like a steamboat willy all over him like even on the ears like he's really detailed he's absolutely gorgeous so he's got his little quote there and yeah he's like he's really shiny and i don't know i just love him i really do he's very detailed like he's, he's got embroidered around the eyes yeah he's gorgeous and then the february one is completely different he's definitely smaller like even on the pants he's smaller um his feet seem the same size and so do his legs he's just a little bit less padded i think i don't know his hands are about the same but yeah he is a little bit smaller his ears are the same though his face is a bit smaller and his body's a bit smaller and then he's got like the waffle all over him so the 1920s waffle which i absolutely love so this this is obviously the first kind of mickey steamboat willy to start the collection and then this is 1920s mickey um, so it's got like the waffle material all over the pants and all over the shoes. No quote uh, on the February one. But it does have the little embroidery thingy on there, like the January one. But no quote, which was a shame. I would have liked a quote. So January's quote matches January's cup, yep. But February doesn't have a quote on the cup or the shoe, which I think is a shame. I think um, they should have put a new quote on every month and then had the cup to match it sort of thing. So that was a bit of a shame, but never mind. So he feels lovely. He's very felt. Um, is that the right material? Like it's called felt. So he was 25. Series 2 of 12, it says on the tag. But yeah, he, he is absolutely gorgeous. He's lovely. So yeah, that is that. And then the January cup matches the first um, plush with the steamboat willies all over it. And then it says in there the quote which matches the plush this one feels so weird it's got all sorts of textures going on um i've just washed this cup actually but the january one i'm drinking out of today so this feels very like almost like matthew held it and he was like oh that's horrible like it is a very I can't explain it like a textured sticky but it's not sticky it's very strange and then this bit's kind of like shiny and then this bit's different again it's waffle and then inside is like ceramic so well it's all ceramic i can't explain it basically it's very it's all different like textures that's so 1920s that bottom brown bit there i love it so yeah it's got the waffles all over it and then no coat just a cup actually this one's clean so i can't show you the other one's got a little bit of tea and silk because i'm drinking out of it but yeah so the only thing i don't like about the cups either is that they don't say like like one of two or two of twelve on them you have to keep the box for it to say that and i don't want to keep the boxes because i want to use them so yeah, that is the cups and the plushes. So these are out every month on 
the 18th of every month, they released more closer up pictures of the cups uh, the other day and I knew May was going to be my favourite just from like the sheet that they put out of up to August. But now there's a closer up one of the May cup, I just know that May is going to be my favourite. It's like a lovely icy pastel blue with like pink on oh it's gorgeous so i definitely need me i mean i want to get all of them but we'll have to see how it goes because it is expensive like i wasn't expecting to get these but i got 20 percent off because that voucher was running and then i got a 15 pound gift voucher off my little sister which you can use in newcastle which is great i didn't realize you could uh because it's all into like the shopping centers so i got these should have been 25 35 37.50 but take 20% off and then with my £15 gift voucher, it was only £15 for the two, which is brilliant. So that's why I managed to get February's. So next month might be a problem. But anyway, I just wanted to show you. I hope that was okay. I know I look a mess and the lighting's funny and everything, but I'm just kind of a bit like hickledy-picky right now. So I'm going to go and just finish making up my dinner. Like it's on the stove. I'm having like a dinner kind of thing. Stove? Wow, how American am I? But yeah, so I need to just uh, get on with it. I think I'm going to end up going to bed because my eyes hurt so much from being on the computer all day. And then tomorrow will be a computer day. I'm really, really sorry, guys. And then Sunday, Matthew, like Matthew's back tomorrow night, Saturday night, off on Sunday. So I think I might take Sunday off and we're going to do something fun because we didn't have any time off on the week he was off last week. And I shouldn't take the day off because I've got a lot to do. Like, I can't even tell you. And we still need to do loads of house stuff. Like, I'm so stressed right now. But once it's all done, or once we start seeing progress, hopefully it'll all be worth it. So, yeah, it, it's exciting. It's just a bit stressful. So, <laughs> fingers crossed it all goes okay. But, yeah, I'm going to go make my dinner. I will be working at the computer tomorrow. And I will get back to you guys probably on Sunday. I'm really sorry. I hope that's okay. Please bear with me. You, I know you guys will be great about it, but I still feel bad. So, I'll be back with you on Sunday. everyone it's Cindy I don't think I spoke to you yesterday I apologize but I was just at the computer all day you really didn't miss anything my skin's so bad because I've like finished my time of the month now and my skin gets really bad and oh honestly just making some pastries you'll have just seen me pick bits of fluff off them because we both dried our hands on this towel that we've had for ages and I mean ages but it still gets fluff everywhere and now it's all over the pastries so that was great but we're just making breakfast and then I think we're gonna be going to the gym and I don't know what we're doing for the rest of the day, but hopefully something exciting. Mm -hmm. Go. Me and Matthew have gotten in for the gym and we're gonna make a pizza. Let's make a pizza. Pizza, pizza. So tasty. Is it not supposed to unroll with the. Oh, that's weird. Maybe it needs to be left longer. Some cheese. I said I'm gonna have the day off today from Secret Project and we're gonna do something fun today. What have we done? I don't know, what did you plan? Nothing. We've been at the gym, that's it. I will admit that I am enjoying the gym more than any other time that I've been. And I don't always go with you, but I do like going with someone. So I do like going with you. So even when I've gone on my own though, I've enjoyed it more than in the past. Mm. 
but that's all we well we visited your parents for like five minutes which i didn't record because there was nothing to record we didn't do anything interesting we've been to the gym and that's it well we went to costa we haven't been to costa for ages but apart from that we didn't do anything interesting it's square mm. yeah i thought it would be round it is on the picture it's not is it not no. well we can't look at the picture because somebody's got the box Do you want to explain what that little scream was? Hey. You're not happy because I just put the frozen meatballs on your back and you screamed like a girl. I screamed like a man. Do you want to? We're going to replay it then. We'll go on! We'll go on! Do you want to replay it and listen to your little screamy? I think we should. Go on then, decorate it pretty. Now that we've replayed your little scream on camera and had a good giggle at you. Oh my god, do not drop that. <laughs> oh, I've got a big zit there, so I'm actually going to cover it because it's that embarrassing. Me and Matthew have just finished watching Castaway, and we're coming to bed now because Matthew's got work tomorrow, and I'm going to edit the weekly vlog. And I'm still working on a secret project, so I hope this week was okay. This is kind of the end of the weekly vlog. Um, yeah, I hope it was okay. I hope you enjoyed it. I promise I will still try and make them as interesting as possible, but I promise as well when secret project is done, it should be worth it. So yeah, I will see you in next week's weekly vlog and my next video. And yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye guys.